No, nah, this, this it was, I wasn't intending to do something, but um, I'm going to do something. Since there's a lot of hip-hop artists here, I'm going to do this poem that is a signature poem of mine, and it's about hip-hop. <laughs> I don't believe in censorship. I believe your art should be your art, so this is what I felt about some shit that happened a long time ago, and so I'm running with it. This is called Mayflower Days. Mayflower Days are coming. On your radio, they're coming. Mayflower days are coming. Now tell me, what are you going to do? When I say radio, you say fuck you, radio. Fuck you. Radio. Fuck you. When I say pop chart, you say fuck you, pop chart. Fuck you. Pop chart. Fuck you. Question. It's the rapper. May I ask you a question? Tell me something. What are you whack ass rappers gonna do when corporate America gives you an open handed slap across your face and says, nigga, we no longer need you? See, like a good hoe, we pimped you and your people for billions of dollars, and now you and your dumb ass people are through. We repeat, it's out with the old nigga and in with the new. I repeat, Toby, I mean nigga, I mean Toby, I mean nigga, I mean Toby, I mean nigga, I mean commodity, we no longer need you. Gangster, I mean wankster, you done sold your soul on the dotted line of the industry prankster, we no longer need you. Now tell me, nigga, what are you and your platinum coated shackle bling bling friends gonna do? See, tonight the stars fall and Jacob the jeweler, he no longer speaks to you. Mentally broke like hammer and rejected by your crew, we repeat, it's murder, ooh, and we no longer need you. You see, cause Grandmaster Flash, get, 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 Master Flash, get, 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 Master Flash and d dead prez can never explain what the message says until all you jiggers stop acting like jigger boos. Rap star, ah. rap star, what are you gonna do? Tell me, what are you gonna do when your conscience comes looking for you? Take a look in the mirror and your reflection says boo see you. House niggas be at master's feet licking that toe jam from his genocidal political coup. Now tell me, nigga, what are you gonna do? I suggest you go take a radio station hostage before your future in this game is through. See, now science tells us that evolution is inevitable, so that means your extinction is simply an inevitability. So you should have listened to Biggie Smalls when he told you to take that shit back to the factory. Now tell me, nigga, what are you going to do? See, Dr. Dre, he done saw your legacy, and now eight miles later, you're through. In the new millennium, even Bobby Brady comes more hardcore than you. So you know what I want you to do? I want you to spread your cheeks wide and prepare to slip and slide because Interscope Records, it wants to fist fuck you. See, hip hop, that shit done with dirty pop with no strings attached. But psych, because it's time Warner that controls you. And though you may be so, so deaf with no limit to your cash money, I'm telling you it's Vivendi that buys and sells you. Now 20, 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 now 30, 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 now 30. Going once, going twice, now you sold. Just like Tupac Shakur to the Japanese consortium in the back death row. You see, it's time for shock treatment because hip-hop has just gone crazy. See, nowadays, $16 will get you 50 cent. Now, that's both Slim and Shady. You see, NBC had to cancel Sanford and Son because it couldn't work with just Lamont and Grady. How in the hell do you expect to enjoy Thanksgiving if you keep watering down that gravy? Last night, a DJ saved my life. Today, future Chuck D's will save me. I want to thank my mama for feeding me, but people, I'm telling you, it was Queen Latifah who raised me. Why are people still calling that bullshit out here on the radio? Hip-hop, when all of his hypocrisy, fake-ass rappers, I'm talking fake-ass rappers, I'm talking we the best fake-ass rappers taking full advantage of the word democracy. You think I'm hating? It's okay. Hating on me? Well, that's okay, too. See, what haters think matters not to me. I say, achoo, in the tissue, because the bitches be like snot to me. I just want them to remember this. No matter how much you bling and shine, you can never, ever polish a turd. Now, don't shoot the messenger. Hey, I'm just telling the truth what you heard in case you didn't know. Hip-hop culture, hip-hop culture currently generates over $200 billion a year, while young ghetto minds remain trapped in a police state, while black and brown people still struggle to eat at the very table we built, while we struggle to enjoy the very food we grew. I'm telling you, nigga! Mayflower days are back, and the new Indian is you. Wake up and take back your legacy.
Does that bullshit you hear on 99 Jams? That bullshit you hear on Power 96? That bullshit you hear on X102.3? That bullshit you hear in them underground stations? That shit ain't hip hop. But it is lyrical hypocrisy. Mayflower days are coming. On your radio, they're coming. Mayflower days are here. The Nina, the Pinta, the Santa Maria, the Illuminati too. What are you gonna do? Peace. Thank you. Okay. I know y'all thought I was gonna like some erotic poetry and shit like that. So, okay. My name's Chris Imperial. I, I'm an independent promoter. Uh, I'm an independent A and R. That's what I am. Um, I am uh, an artist myself. And I'm here to help you. I'm here to help those that, for whatever reason, have moved me through your performance in some way so that I can try and open up a door for you. That's what I do, because I've already had my day in the sun, and like nobody's signed, a 40-year-old dude, so I'm trying to get y'all signed. The day, the day they sign me, uh, you know, it's to hell with all y'all. You know what I'm saying? No, no, no.